pretty snowfield. Yeah. Red-haired villagers walked the snowy ground of Pinecone Village as the smell of hot cocoa filled the air. Mm, hot cocoa. I see. This is where you're supposed to get zombie brains. Hey, what's up? Care to try my archery game? Win fancy prizes. All five arrows must hit a target to win. It's 25 coins to play. Yeah, right. Now, okay. Wow, that's it, huh? Oh no. I'm facing the wrong direction. Okay. <laughs> I thought for sure that was going to do you in. Hey, alright, nice I win. Yeah, alright. I wasn't saving this money to do anything with. I mean... Shush you. <laughs> Shush you, gambling. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Sorry. I'm only laughing because I know that it's going to want 75 or 100 next. I know. This isn't it. It never is. Ah, oh, come on. Oh. Alright, fine. <laughs> Double put bed. There's a magic necklace somewhere. <laughs> yeah, let's be walk normally on ice. Got it. Found it already. Oh, do you walk normally on ice? Well, I slide a little bit, but... Oh look, I can buy druid feathers. Oh, what's that one do? That's a mushroom soup. Ah. They're saving for a tropical trip. <laughs> That's delightful. Yep, and this blizzard now zombies, okay. is your resurrection flower cost? 500? Okay. I mean, it makes sense. Flowers would be real expensive in a nice area. Yeah. You castle folks. <laughs> oh. Do they not talk to you? Alright, just take their stuff then. Oh, it's a scroll. I had a lovely stay at Pinecone Village. Even though it's very cold, the people always have a big smile on their face. My next stop is Frostroot Shrine. They say you have to cross a giant snowy cemetery to get there. Should be no problem with some tasty hot cocoa to keep my buns from freezing. And if they do, I'll take a dip in the hot springs along the way. Oh, there is a hot springs. Oh, neat. That's handy. Dr. Zombies. <laughs> Alright. You have zombies in the... He Do does. you not watch zombie movies? <laughs> the oh. scoundrel. How dare he steal my magic running shoes. After all the trouble I went to steal them from Sage the Mage. Curse you, Karma. My dreams of owning the fastest mushroom soup delivery service are over. But the joke's on him. I had a cobbler resize them to fit my small, but manly, feet. When he realizes this, he'll probably just give them away as a prize for one of his dumb races. I'd go after him up to Snowfall Summit, but just the thought of walking at normal speeds makes me tired. <laughs> hey, what's up? Why are you so angry? I was once a respected scientist for my research on the effects of magic on the dead. My goal was to create a vaccine that would prevent necromancers from using bodies for evil. Oh. 
But then the king's brother accused me of trying to raise an undead army. I was banished from the kingdom and forced to set up shop in this winter wasteland. If only I could continue my research. I'm very low on test subjects and collecting zombie brains is dangerous work. Do you like fighting zombies? I'll reward you each time you bring me 20 brains. Okay. Yeah, worth a shot. Okay, but like... I can see why you'd get banished for your creepy room of chained up zombies. Yeah. But on the other hand, I can see why Crocious would be keen to get rid of someone who's trying to stop necromancers from raising the dead. Also true. But I can see why he was able to do it without raising much uh, alarm there. Oh no. A health potion. Yeah, I'll give you a health potion. Yay, piece of heart. That was worth it. Nice. Now I'm gonna steal your money. Oh, it's a scroll. Everyone says I have a death fish for wanting to travel to the monk temple. It's not my fault I'm crazy about adventure. Let's see. Once I reach the hot springs, they said to go north to where some hermit guy lives. From there, I should eventually half high in the temple if I keep going east. Let's do this. I do appreciate this plucky adventure that we get to sort of follow the yeah the meta of it's it's the meta plot in this book that we're telling. Just what I have enough coins for. <laughs> They're just a little far away for that. Hey, I got my coins. I got 25 coins back for hitting a bullseye. Nice. Hooray. Energy's always nice. Alright, now what? Hey, I got the record. Oh, is that really it? That might be it. Alright. I thought for sure there was going to be at least one more round of it, but... Me too. <laughs> Let's see, so we're going to... Gotta go back to the honeycomb guy. Oh, right. Let's see, was he further down the road? I forget. We kind of just started yes. going. And yeah, they all came back. You were gonna have to do more than one run through there because. There literally weren't enough honeycomb or enough yeah. hives to produce honeycombs. Almost there. Sixteen to twenty. <laughs> some for whatever the thingy was that needed one of everything. Right. So, uh... You know what just occurred to me is, is that you have a, uh, a magic attack that's like a ground pound Yeah. that you literally never use. I mean, why would I? I've already got a ground pound. I just, just realized that there was a couple times where it would have hit all three of the uh, hives. Oh, yeah. Don't know if it would have hit the bees, though, since they're not on the ground, you know? Got a cream that works great in case you got stung. The knight commander uses it for the rashes he gets from his armor. <laughs> All right, well. I'm not supposed to tell anyone. The beekeeper handed her a small medallion that hummed and buzzed in her hand. As long as she held it, bees would come to her aid whenever she called for them. That's neat. I got summoned bee. It's a spell. It's a powerful medallion. It summons cute little bees. Did that guy have a name? Or was it just Beekeeper? Just Beekeeper. Okay, it's official. His name is Burt's Bees. There you go. He's Burt's Bees. Good job, you figured it out. Yep. Yeah. 
Still got a resurrection flower. Okay, so I didn't find the bit along the coast where I shoot the, uh... Oh, where you shoot that, uh... Door. Thingy. Yeah. So that's weird. Yeah. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Go away, birds. It really follows you through the screen transitions, at least. Otherwise, that could be bad. And probably easier to program this way, anyway. Um, wouldn't it be about here-ish? No, that's the lift that I accidentally got onto again, because it sucks you inside when you get too close to the door. Didn't find the guy to give the letter to either, did I? He's in Pinecone Village. Isn't that this place? Yes. But I don't know if you've looked at every place in Pinecone Village either. I also don't remember who you're looking for, so I don't know what to what to say there. Good point. The Council of... Ah, <laughs> the Council of There's the Red Sun. One? There's another song. Huh. Over the graves and through the woods To Frostroot Shrine we go The monks came today to show us the way Through the white and drifted snow Over the graves and through the woods Oh, how the wind does blow It sings the toes and it bites the nose As up the mountain we go Nice. Feels like a Christmas song. A little bit. Yeah, that's true. King Orchid isn't coming alive to eat our brains. It's true. We're very fortunate in that regard. Hooray, hearts. And... Is this your letter? It is! I delay my delivery because of mushroom season. Yeah. By the time I thought I'd already be soaked with my red haired body in my own private hot tub. Oh well. Don't tell anyone. I really don't care. <laughs> what does mushroom soup do? Well, you've drank two of them. I uh, must give back energy. Because mm. otherwise it does nothing. That makes sense. It's green like the color of your energy bar. Oh, yeah. I guess if you were bigger on the magics and uh, not a strong proponent of the slam attack... Uh, oh, that would make sense, yeah. Having more of those might be worth your while. Well, let's go grab some more of those. And we'll pick up uh, some more mail while we're at it. For whatever the next place is. If there is a next place. Deliver this piece of mail to Crocious! Uh... <laughs> I don't think it's going to be rough to... To read it, but uh, okay. I had a fair few mushrooms from going to the place with all the mushrooms. Right. Hey, I should talk to the night commander, see how many creatures I've killed. And then you can tease him about the fact that he has to use Bert's bees because he's armor chiefs. Ah. Uh, is that up here? Or is that. 
No. Whatever number of creatures it is, it has to be just a crazy number by now. Oh, yeah. True valiancy in protecting Blossom Kingdom. Our home is safer thanks to you. The knights pitched in and got you something special. Enjoy. Ooh. Lily had been given a special gift. Now she could perform a roundhouse attack instantly. Roundhouse attack. For 1,640. Wow. Okay. It's a roundhouse attack. That one. The roundhouse is the spin one, isn't it? I don't know. Bees! I don't actually know what a roundhouse attack is. It's not... Oh... Cool. It does use a uh, magic. Magic now, though. Still, that's neat. Yeah. All right, postman. Still wish I had dash boots. It does sound like there are some. True. That thief guy mentioned them, so... It just would be nice if you'd have gotten them a little earlier in the game. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, dude? <laughs> oh, you can't think of a more rewarding job than being a mail carrier. <laughs> Postmaster's pretty great, too, though. Used to the bard in the small Golem's Haven village. Okay. I mean, I've been there. But you didn't take it to the bard last time. No, I did not. It was like a weird love letter last time, wasn't it? Yeah. Alright. Interesting. Well, let's hit up Golem's Haven. I need to save up 300 gold for that, uh... Extra bomb recipe? Yeah. Bomb plus? It's probably going to be an item like, or uh, an equipable like the uh, instant roundhouse. Oh, I could see that. Okay. Do you remember where the bard is? No clue. I think he was in like the main hall, uh, the room with the big like boiling pot of green stuff. Oh, that would make sense. Pretty sure he's along the back, right? Hey, yeah, there he is. A letter for you. Oh, just another dumb letter from his dad. Doesn't appreciate my profession. Doesn't respect my music. Not everyone oh. wants to be a knight commander like you. <laughs> Some of us want to sing and dance and... Okay, neat. So, that is the knight commander's son there. Brilliant. He wants to be a musician, dad. <laughs> Oh, did you buy feathers from that guy? I bought feathers from somebody else, so I had enough feathers to turn into a mega profit. Ah. Neat. Okay. Next up in Lily's Adventures of Mail Carrying. <laughs> I do still think it'd be funny if, if there's like a, an extra bit where you get a piece of mail for Crocious. <laughs> just, just a little offhanded extra bit of dialogue before the fight starts. Of, oh, oh what, what's that? I'm, now no, you die. Wait, wait, wait. Got a letter for you. Oh, oh. Do, do, do I have to sign for it? Like signs off on it, reads his letter. And it's like, oh, thank you very much. Uh, and now I you die. To, I still have to kill you, though. Like, I mean, you know, evil army and all that. It's dark over Yeah, I understand. It's fine. Okay, so now we go to the Wiss witch and gasping. What did she collect again? 
Uh, Souls. Souls, right. The little, uh, cans of RC Cola. Yeah. Big soda aficionado there. Yep. Well, you see, she's making her own pooch out in the bog. And, oh. uh, she needs a chaser. Yeah. You know, it's very peaty. It's kind of a... Kind of a whiskey and coke sort of situation. You right. Know? I'm glad you remember the way. She was the place you ended up at when we didn't know where we were going. Yep. Hey, what's up? Got a letter for you. Been waiting wow. on this letter for 27 years. <laughs> Secret Witches Guild. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. <laughs> I hope that in the 27 years it took this application to get to me, <laughs> <laughs> that they still right. exist. Yeah, that's a thing. It's like when you get a bunch of Costco coupons from like two months ago, so it's like, <laughs> oh, great, I can see all the things I could have saved money on. Thanks. Yep. Good times. Alright, postman. Need that 300 GP. Seriously, I hope there is some little extra at the end. Not just an item, but like a oh yeah, a fun bit of dialogue for something grinding through the mail quest that you're doing. Although I will say that just finding out that the Knight Commander's son is a bard that uh, is pretty is fun. pretty good. So. All right, mailman. What else you get? <laughs> okay. Oh. We're the first person to manage to deliver mail and not get turned into goo by the witch. That's a thing. That's some information that's weird. Definitely making me think that that book was uh was her book. With yeah. regards to the like turning one's back on that order and becoming a, a knight or a disciple of the Black Rose. And... Yeah, no, that's definitely a, a villain thing. <laughs> it's a shame. She seems so nice when we show up. Like, I mean, we, really we are helping to... her gather souls for black magic. I'm just saying, we seem to get along really well. So, you know, the idea that we might actually have to fight her at the end of the game is a little bit sad. <laughs> well, they wouldn't have us fight their, uh... Their collective thought person? Yeah. Probably not. Only 50 more coins. I will destroy a hundred stools if I have to. <laughs> Doing okay? Oh. Oh, hey. Got a letter from her hunk boyfriend. He was a disciple, but I guess he's now in a cooler group. Oh, oh no. no. I've got some bad news for you. Oh no. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Well, now we have to see where this goes. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, we just... We're finding out a lot about some of these side characters <laughs> right now. And down. Disciple of the Black Rose. They Whoops. sound real cool. Oh. Oh, no. Now I'm thinking my joke of, like... Delivering mail to like <laughs> Crocus might actually be possible now. Turns out the mail carrier's been a uh, agent of Crocus all along, oh, organizing that would be. a. Yeah. 
Stan of Stan's Traveling Salesman. Delivered to his tent just outside Pinecone Village. Okay. We haven't seen his uh, location there, have we? No, we have not. But I have enough to buy my bombs. Well, I yeah, should check in he... with the archery guy and see if he has more. But then you won't be able to buy anything from Stan. Oh, right. He got them good deals. But bombs. Bomb <laughs> upgrade. Okay. Come on, making up those stairs. Oh yeah, we never did the wishing well either. Five hundred for that. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. It's probably a resurrection flower. That would track. All right, bomb jerk. Yeah. Bomb plus. <laughs> oh yeah, that's definitely a couple more. Yay, we're broke. <laughs> but now you can't do your cool uh, instant. No. Uh, that's okay. a bigger boom. Yeah. But now you can't do your uh, instant uh, attack. You can equip two things. Anyway, uh, next time on Endless Mode, we'll... Finish, finish up our postal quest, and then, I don't know, maybe save the king, I guess. I guess, if there's time, you know. <laughs>